<laughs> oh, there we go. Broadcast is live. We are live. Yay. Hey, Emily, can you see the, um, the, oh, whoops, can you see the comments as well? Yes, I can. You can see. Amazing. Okay, cool. Well, Damien's asked if he can watch back another time because it's 1 a.m. in the morning. Of oh, my God. Can. <laughs> yes. So I hope you're watching this later. Um, I'm here with Emily. Yeah. <laughs> and we met once. Yes, once. <laughs> Just once. But uh, Emily's been coming to um, to the live stream, to the origami streams for the last four or five weeks. Yeah. Yes, it's been Lady, fun. Lady Snapshot from Twitch says, hi, Emily. Hi. Uh, there she goes. <laughs> yeah. So right now we're streaming on Twitch, on YouTube, on Face and on Facebook. So um, welcome to everybody who's watching. Yeah, it's a, uh, it's been a, it's been a pretty hot week. It really feels like summer has hit LA. Yeah. Um, what's it like where you're watching from? Oh my goodness, we have twelve people already. That's amazing. Yay! Yay! Uh, where you know if you if you're watching, please let us know in the comments where you're from, where you're watching from. Is it hot where you are right now? <laughs> has summer hit you? Anything? Um, and what good things happened this week for you? Um, how about you, Emily? What good things happened for you? This oh, week? let's see. That's a hard one. I don't even know. Well, I guess just being able to, um, I, I work at the Suji Chef Institute in Torrance. And so being able to honestly, every day, see these students make, uh, like master making sushi, honestly, is just a joy for me. And I manage all of their social media. So it's fun to be able to take behind the scenes and, you know, have fun with that. So I think every day is a highlight, honestly. That's amazing. That's so yeah. cool. Imagine getting to work with sushi students. Do you oh. get to sample sushi? Ah! Every day we get, I get glorious, like amazing lunch. We get to eat sushi oh my every goodness. day. <laughs> I haven't gotten tired of it yet, so. Can I come? <laughs> yes, please do. We love visiting. Oh, that would be awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, um, okay, so it rained all day in Pittsburgh, apparently. Oh, I'm sorry. Big storms. <laughs> Grass yeah. is happy, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, James is watching from the UK. It's 1 a.m. there right now, right? I think someone else is commenting. <laughs> and Mookie's back, yeah, aloha. Awesome, Wallace Nelson says, that's awesome, but I don't know to what. Um, must have been something that we said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, Wallace G A. Where's that? Where's G G A? Georgia. Georgia. Mhm. Mm okay. Cool. Awesome. So, uh, welcome back to our weekly live stream. Emily has been has been commenting on the live streams the last four or five weeks, and I was like, you know, you're here every week. You should actually be here with me today. So, thank so you for joining you. me. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, Emily and I have one thing in common. Um, well, a few things in common. Um, we are both half Japanese. Is that right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Good. <laughs> like, Actually, yeah. no. I'm Italian. I'd be like, ah. Okay. Good. Um, so we're both half Japanese. Were you born here? You yes, born I was in born in Michigan. Actually, born and raised okay. in Michigan, and then moved out to LA about almost a year ago. Amazing. So I'm out. <laughs> Welcome. And so that's how that's how we met, I think, was we met on a half Japanese group and yes. we were like, I'm just I'm new to LA looking for friends. And I said, I'll be your friend. Yeah, so <laughs> that's right, someone. I don't know anyone. And then we met once and that was it. And yeah. so now. <laughs> it worked out. Yeah, well LA can be a bit like that. We're like, we should hang out sometime and then it doesn't happen. <laughs> right, yeah, right. Uh, well, the pandemic changed a lot of things. <laughs> oh my goodness, yeah, the pe yeah. <laughs> that changed a lot. I was like, wow, I chose the probably the worst time to choose to move to an other side of the nation with no friends or family. <laughs> but you know, it's okay. <laughs> You're here now. Yeah, it's okay. exactly, and I have great friends, so it was worth Amazing. it. <laughs> so good. <laughs> yeah, so, um, you know, it all just, it all happens for a reason. You're here for a reason. Mm -hmm. We're here today for a reason. I'm so excited oh, yeah. to have you. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> and thank you everyone for coming today. I am um, I'm so happy to see you all here. It's always really scary because I'm not sure if anyone's gonna come or not. 
<laughs> but um, but you know, it's always fun. No matter who's here, it's always fun. And today, um, Emily, I so I asked Emily this week what she would like, and she said flowers would be cool. And I thought flowers would be cool. And so I thought we could go with a seasonal flower today. And um, I haven't made an example yet, but would you? I, would everyone be up for making hydrangeas? This is like just a part of it. We're going to make a whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Ross. Hi, Kat and Emily just popped in to say hello. Oops, cool. Well, I don't know if I can feature comments, but someone said here, I'm from Michigan. <gasps> Who is that? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that username. <laughs> We're in Michigan. I'm from Grand Rapids. <laughs> I think Ross is from Torrance. He said the weather's about oh, really? the same. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Good. If it was that different, it would be crazy. Uh, yes. Wow. Thank you, everyone, for for your comments. I'm trying to keep up with them all. All right. So uh, I hope you're all ready. Well, I, I'm going to give everyone a little bit of time to get ready. So if you have a song request, I'd be happy to sing you a song. One song before we start to kind of give you time to get paper and cut them because today we are going to need to cut paper into a quarter of the size of this and we're going to maybe need I don't know how many we need maybe 12 to 16 tiny little ones we might not make them all here we might do but um have you got origami paper Emily mm -hmm. I'm all yeah, mm -hmm. oh, it's the same pack I have. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> I got it from Daiso. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> yes. Daiso. So, um, Daiso is awesome, everyone, if you want origami paper. Oh, yeah. So, I recommend. We also have many other great products that I love. <laughs> yes. So good. Okay. So I haven't cut mine yet because I've just been running it. around like crazy. Scissors. So I will, um, I'll cut, I'll cut mine too. James said, can you sing one of your songs? Absolutely. Um, can I just choose? I guess I can just choose one of my songs. Yeah, pick your favorite. Okay, I'll do that. Um, let's go with it. Let's go with... Ooh, do, 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 do. <clears throat> what to do, what to do. Um, I'm gonna... I wanna stand and I don't have a strap for this, so I'm gonna my ukulele. The new one, acoustic. The new one, acoustic. Do you mean outside, inside, Wallace? Why don't I do outside, inside then? Okay. Do, do, do. I wish you could cut the paper for me, Emily. I know, it's like it's just over, right? <laughs> yeah. Not that bad. Okay. I hope everyone is getting their pieces of paper and cutting them. I'll just, you're gonna get, show you first. I wanna make sure you're all ready. Okay. Okay. So, cut them to squares about that size. Like three inch squares, three inch squares, or even smaller if you want to. If you want to use post-it notes because you don't have colored paper, you can even like, we could make yellow hydrangeas today. That's fine. All right. So just cut them to pieces about that size. <laughs> Maximilians, go Spartans. Is this the Spartans color? Yes. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, from Grand Rapids. Yes. Go stay. <laughs> Maximilians from France. Oh, but I, you sometimes visit Michigan, don't you? <laughs> I all love right. that we see all these Midwest people. You know, Midwest people are the nice people. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> They're not. They are, right? They're yeah, we're nice. Midwest. Like the stereotype is, we're all very nice, apparently. <laughs> yeah, I follow. Um, I follow a Midwestern comedian on Instagram, and he's like, he's like that very. All, all oh really? His, oh, I think he's comedy. Last week. All of his comedy is like Midwestern comedy. It's really funny. He's That's great. funny. Yeah. I'll check him out. <laughs> All right, cool. So this one is called Outside Inside. While I'm singing, go get some paper, cut it up, have maybe like 12 pieces, kind of like the size, and we'll get going. We're gonna make hydrangeas. Amazing, just like that. Cool. La 
Death of the party, that's what they call me. Snap another shot to upload to my story. The lines I'm rehearsing, don't wanna be boring. All the voices keeping me up till the morning. How am I walking? What am I wearing? If I'm honest, it can get a little exhausting. Take a step back and take a deep breath and just. outside inside and um, let's get going with our origami um, I should have a little like little catchphrase for this thing um, I don't know if, do you know Jim Gaffigan Jim Gaffigan no Jim Gaffigan's like a comedian and lately he's had this quarantine cooking series called let's get cooking and it's like let's get cooking there's this like thing that he constantly says and there's a little thing that pops up. I should have something like that. Yeah, you Let's should. Origami. <laughs> <laughs> I like and it. He, and he says it every 10 seconds and the thing pops <laughs> up every like 10 seconds. <laughs> I like that to remind people in case no one remembers. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Yeah. Oh, thanks for all the, uh, the little emojis, emotes. It's been so fun. I've been on um, Twitch trying a bunch of things out, but Twitch is really fun because a lot of these emotes kind of pop up and and it's like it feels like a game. It's so crazy. Yeah. All right. So I need to catch up with everyone. <laughs> I need to cut these myself. But let me get my little uh, let me get my screen. Oops. Sharing. Add to stream. Let's do this. So we are going to make hydrangeas today and it's going to look beautiful. Yay. Good morning. Japan, it is 9 a.m. Asakuji desu ne? Yeah. So, kyo wa ajisai wo tsukurimasu. We are going to make hydrangeas. So, get some paper, get some post its if you want to. They'll save you from having to cut paper. Oh, you're doing it the right way using that, using a cutter. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. See, I'm not sure if it's gonna be exact today, but that's okay. It doesn't need to look. Ugh. Okay, awesome. Live, yes, we are live. Somebody's asking if we're live. So, the first thing we're gonna do is we are going to 
um, we are going to just get one piece of paper and if you have a colored side and a white side then put the colored side up if you have just both colors it doesn't matter um, and you're going to do corner to corner so like so corner to corner yep this was not straight <laughs> it's okay mine isn't either <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> corner to corner you could even do this with a bunch right now if you're waiting while you're waiting for everyone because we need to make a few of these <laughs> and once you are once you feel like you're ready for the next step just give me a, a thumbs up give me a thumbs up in the um in the comments and once i get five or six thumbs up we will move on i don't know if you need to do this with all of them but you can if you want to oh, quite a few maybe i'll just do how many have i got I'll just do a couple more. All right. Yeah. Do, 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 do. <laughs> How many are you going to do, Emily? I don't know. I keep folding and I have quite a few here. I think I have like 12. <laughs> so yeah. as many as I can fold. <laughs> I wonder if 12 is too much even. I'm not sure. I don't know. I'd rather have too many than none of So. <laughs> We can always make them more. True. Better. Okay, so here we have a bunch of folded triangles. Now what we're going to do is open them up and just do the other way. So we're going to do a crisscross. Open them up, close them the other way. Mine are not straight. <laughs> it's okay, mine aren't either. <laughs> it's really difficult to make them straight. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so while we're doing this, um, I want to ask you some questions. Have you have you lived in Japan, Emily? Yeah, I guess you could say I lived part time, kind of. Uh, so I grew up I uh, in the school year months in Michigan, and then every summer. I would go to Japan and my mother was a Japanese professor. So she would actually have my brother and I go to Japanese school. Um, oh while we were in Japan. Yeah. And then when I was younger, when I lived in Michigan, uh, I would go to regular school five days a week and then Saturday Japanese school on, on, on Saturday. So, yeah. Yeah. So yeah, I went to, home to Japan every summer up mm -hmm. until I was probably like a junior in college. Yeah. So yeah, it was like my second home. <laughs> you know what? I think I've just changed my mind on how we're gonna do this. <laughs> just do it like this. We're just gonna do it. Hopefully this will make it easier. Triangles. All right. Wallace said I should have bought post-it. No for next time. Yeah, totally. I mean it could be post-its, but it doesn't have to be. You could just cut copy paper. Um it just needs to be little squares. Posted might might work actually better because it's actually a right square. <laughs> like, it's um, it's square. <laughs> the only problem with post-its is that it sticks. Right. I've tried making things with post-its before, but they do stick. So it just depends. Mm -hmm. So now we're going to fold these into um, just another triangle. So fold them over like this and into just from this to this, fold it over again. We're gonna do this with all of them. So fold it over like so, like that. <laughs> it's nice when you have so many because you get to practice and you get to do the same thing over and over. So it helps to kind of solidify what you're That's doing. True. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, close this over. Um, so it's something that uh, I've been talking about recently and thinking about is Japanese school lunches. <laughs> yes. Um, they are really amazing. 
They're so intricate. I remember my mom would make them so intricate, and I just, I mean, I was insane. It's just crazy. Oh, your mom would make them? Yeah, when I was younger, she'd make them when we went to Saturday school. Um, but I mean, as we got older, we had to do our own. Well, I wouldn't even make the, I wouldn't make the bid though, because I didn't have the techniques, <laughs> technique or the time to be able yeah. to you know. But they were always, one, they were delicious, but two, they were just always so beautiful. Mm. You know, like carrots cut in little hearts and the yeah. perfect tamagoyaki. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So uh, the word bento, for everybody who doesn't know, is it means lunchbox. So, you know, uh, when when people say bento box, they're saying lunchbox box. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> bento means is a Japanese word for lunchbox. And um, yeah, and then like, some of the, the mothers make amazing lunches. My mom was never into that. So I loved those types of lunches, but my mother would never make that for me. <laughs> okay, I hope we're ready for the next step. I haven't gotten a thumbs up, but are we ready to go? I hope so. When everyone's focused, you know, you can't type and do this at the same time. So here we Everyone go. Everyone needs an assistant, right? <laughs> yeah, I know. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're going to make this, this triangle into a square. And how we're going to do that is we are going to put our thumb or finger into here and push down this way. Okay, so uh, put our finger or thumb into here and then push down. So triangle into a square. Does that make sense, Emily? Did I say that? Yes, okay. that does. Yeah, I mean... Okay. It's one of those, it's visual. I mean, when I learned origami, you just stick your thumb in it and then. Yeah, that's I always have a mouth, you're just flattening the mouth. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that helps. Okay, and then we're gonna turn it over and same thing. We're going to kind of get this, this flap and open it up, bring this flap to the center, put our thumb in here or finger, thumb or finger in here and then push down and flatten, you squash it. <laughs> Hello. You got me on Facebook. Thanks for watching on Facebook. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So it should look like this on one side, kind of like this, and then it'll be closed on one side. Okay, I'll keep doing this with a few others and then we'll move on. All right, so again, put our thumb in, close it like so. And then flip it over, open and close. Yeah. All right. So, um, so you did origami when you were young, right, Emily? Yes, I did. What, do you remember the first thing that you folded? I think it was a box. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. and then after that, a, cr a crane, I think. A crane. Yeah, and I think those are the two ones that I would always make all the time. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and then a, um, I think it was a flower. It was one where it was like, I don't know what kind of flower it was, but it was one where it had um, like the like all the petals where like you would curl it with a pencil. It's a lily. <clears throat> lily, yes, thank you. I was thinking about that today. Um, Those are fun, but it is a little bit complicated. <laughs> yes, yes. Oh yeah, Naive says I heard that it is known for hydrangeas in yeah. the summer. Yeah, it totally is. Um, right now. Kind of Oh, sorry, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, right now, especially because it's it's um, rainy season. So what were you going to say? I was going to say, yeah, right now it's Ajisai season. Ajisai, that's what they call it. Ajisai. It's my grandmother's favorite flower. <laughs> <laughs> really? Well, I, you know, I love these colors, so I, I kind of see that. Yeah, they're so pretty. Yeah. Except when they fall and you have to clean them up, then that's a pain. <laughs> I've never had to do that. Yeah, I think uh, we would do it from time to time in Japan. 
we would have like the different neighbor neighborhoods would have like cleaning days where everyone as like the street would come and just clean all of the drainage systems and everything. Mm -hmm. And if the hydrangea fell and it was rainy, it was really difficult to get all the tiny petals and everything. Yeah. But they're pretty though. <laughs> yeah, they are. They're beautiful. I love them. Lady Snipeshot says, uh, I used to make pianos. Oh, yeah. Wow. I'm thinking about doing a piano tutorial here, too. I, mean, I don't think I've made a piano. What do you got me for? It's really, really easy. Oh, really? Yeah. Yay. Something just happened on Twitch. I heard something. What was it? I, I'm, I don't know. <laughs> Lady Snipeshot, <laughs> tell me what happened. I can't see. <laughs> It's it's on Twitch. I get these um I get these audio alerts, but I've got no idea what's <laughs> happening right now because I'm streaming to multiple platforms. So, anyway, um. <laughs> oh, thank you, Lady Snap Snipe Shot. Snipe shot. <laughs> what's that? She's gonna check for you. <laughs> yeah, be awesome. Maybe somebody just uh just followed me. Okay, new follower. Yay! Thanks for following whoever it was. Um, <laughs> Okay. All right. JC the Flying Ace. What's up? Welcome. Thank you for commenting, everyone. And Maximilian's given us a thumbs up, so he's ready to move on. Okay. It's like everyone's like, come on, speed up. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, um, you know, we were watching this YouTube video recently of school lunches in Japan. And it was amazing just to see how much effort they put into the menus. Like, they don't serve the same meal, like, for, I don't know, a month. Like, they, they won't serve the same meal in 30 days, within 30 days. Yeah, it's crazy. I remember when I would go to school in Japan, uh, well, one, the students all served, we served each other. Like we were, I mean, in Japan, in the school systems, there's no janitors. So the students are responsible for all that. And so they made the meals in-house at the schools and they had the cooks and everything. And then we would bring it up in a, like a food elevator and bring it up to whatever floor our class was. And we would all have amazing lunches. Like I just remember every day it was like, it was a feast. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, and then, and then, yeah, I remember, like, I would have to clean toilets with my cousin, <laughs> that was her job, like, you know, it was just so crazy. That's fun. I remember having uh, competitions down the hall, we would all be on our hands and knees, like a dog, with a rag on the floor, and we'd have a race of how fast we could push the rag across the opposite side of the hallway yeah. by, like, running, like, with our, just our feet, it was fun. Yeah, so crazy. <laughs> Someone here is asking, um, what other platforms are you streaming to? Only me here on Facebook. So I'm streaming to Facebook, but a few different things in Facebook. And I'm streaming to YouTube. And I'm streaming to Twitch right now. And then Emily's joining me. So um, that's that's the that's the crew you're part of right now. Thanks for joining me. Yeah. OK, so here we are. We have all of these things. Um, just however many you want to have right now. If you just have one, that's fine, too. So what we're going to do now is we are going to just make sure that it's this side is open, okay? And we are going to fold this closed side, this closed side down like this. So this side is open, the side is closed, and we are going to fold like so. Make sense? It's going to be open this side. And then flip it over and do the same thing. Yeah. So do you have a favorite song that you've written? Or are they all just equally your favorite? <laughs> all, all equally my favorite. They're amazing. Yeah. I love them. I always have them on my playlist. Oh, thank you. Thanks for adding me to your playlist. Yeah, of course. I think it just depends. It depends on um, how I'm feeling that day. There are some that I absolutely love listening to, but I don't enjoy singing as much because they're maybe really hard to sing. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. 
<laughs> yeah, so it just depends on the day. I mean, there's some that I that mean a lot to me, and then there are just some that are super fun to sing. So I don't know, um, but I've really, you know, I really like all the songs I've released recently. And yeah, me too. I think they're my yeah. favorite so far. Thank you. Yeah, and then I'm releasing uh, pretty soon, actually, July, July 25th, I think. I haven't announced it yet. Now you all know um, I'm going to release an acoustic version of Outside Inside with Eden Kai. Oh, that's exciting. Yeah, so that's really exciting. Okay. I think what I look like this. Oh, sorry. <laughs> well, I hope everyone's um, origami looks like this. This side's going to be open. So I'm going to, uh, to keep doing this with all the other ones. So you want to keep this side open. Just remember that. <laughs> Were you in Kona, Emily? No. No, it was not. Oh, for someone else. Oh, <laughs> I was like, sorry, I have no idea what Kona is. Kona, um, Kona, Hawaii. Oh, I've actually never been to Hawaii. I wish I could. <laughs> uh, yeah, Lady Snapshot said she needs origami paper. Hers is super thick. It's true. Oh, it might yeah. be a little bit hard, actually, with really thick paper. I'll keep doing this. I definitely would try to switch to, like, copy paper as an alternative. Copy paper but it might be good. Be, yeah. Oh, yeah, because she has colored paper. Oh, is that what she's using? Yeah, and color paper might be more like card. Yeah. Yes. And Luki says, you need to visit. I know, I would love to. <laughs> yeah. Everyone yeah. thinks it's true paradise. We've got two people here watching from the big island. Really? Oh, I'm jealous. It's always been a dream of mine to go. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm so sad I can't be there this year. Were you, song, were you planning to? There's a songwriting festival that I go to every year. Oh, is that the Kona Songwriters Festival? Yeah, it's uh, the Hawaii Songwriting Festival. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Ed, Ed's in, you're in Canada, yeah? Ed says, good evening. Just dropped by to say hello. Going to grab a bite since we're finally in phase two. Oh, that's awesome. Restaurants are finally open. Well, take care. Be careful out there. <laughs> yes, be careful. Have you eaten out yet? I don't think I haven't. I don't think I have. I've gone to a uh, like a coffee shop um, in Anaheim. Mm -hmm. They're starting to open up everything versus more LA County. Yeah. But there's still, I mean, everyone is still kind of, you know, being cautious, which is good. But I think we're going through another another spike again, <laughs> unfortunately. Because I know, you know, now that beaches are all open and everything like that. And um, I think a few weeks ago, I went to Marina Del Rey and Beach and <laughs> social distancing. It was as if it didn't exist. <laughs> like, yeah. tons of people. <laughs> yeah, I know. It's crazy. Yeah, um, I, I think I surf, so I've started going out again, which is awesome. So I go out once a week. Uh, you but, surf? You know, it's amazing. Yeah, but I went out um, to PV Cove the other day. There were no waves, but there were no people. Oh. But there was just like no one there. It was amazing. Wow. Yeah. You have to teach me how to surf. That's always been a long, like a, a, a bucket list of mine. Yes. You know, the closest ocean I got was Lake Michigan. Granted, it's really big, but the waves yeah. are, you know, like the Pacific, so. Yeah, it's, um, it's, it's fun. And I mean, if you, if you just go on a day when the waves are really small, it's, it's great. I love it. Yeah. That's awesome. <laughs> I'm too chicken too, Lady Snipeshot, <laughs> but I want to try. <laughs> This is what I was responding to. <laughs> yes, <Yeah>, sorry. <laughs> I know not everyone gets to see everyone else's comments because oh, that's right. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> awesome. Okay, almost there. I hope we're ready to go on, move on. Just realized it's already five thirty-seven. Oh my gosh, it's great because when I have someone to talk to, it's um. <laughs> time to yeah, start. you should have a guest every week. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I was supposed to, but the last few weeks it's just been a little mad and I don't know. Yeah. I've just been doing it on my own. Okay. 
cool. I think I died in the water in a past life, or maybe. <laughs> okay, I hope we're ready to move on. So I'm just going to move these to the side. We've got one here. And we are going to um, fold this side over to, over to the top, or halfway. Maybe just below it, like that. Awesome. And then what we're going to do is once we fold it um, like this, I'll just show you the first one. We're going to open it up like that. See that? Oh my gosh, that's so cool. Yeah, it's really cute. I've actually never made this one. Yeah, it's cool, huh? Yeah. We're open it up. And then let's just do that with all of them. And then there's one more step to kind of pinch in the sides. So we'll do that with all of them first. It's actually great we get to do this so many times because you really do get the hang of it after a while. That's very true. <laughs> Open it up. Whoop, whoop, whoop. And you don't need to flatten it the whole way because you might maybe want a little bit of texture and 3D, a 3D feel. Let's do this a little bit. Hold it over. Yeah. All right. Open it up. And fold it over. Open it up. Yeah, maybe you don't need 12. Maybe 12 is a little overkill. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta make enough for a second one, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. If anybody has requests too of things that they want me to, you know, things you want me to look into, things I can fold, show you how to fold, you just let me know. All right, cool. Got a bunch? I need to sneeze. Ah. <laughs> Bless you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Getting bless you in the comments. Thank you. <laughs> Oops, how do I undo this? Ah. <laughs> Multiple blessings. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Cool. Okay. So let me um, just move on for those who are ready. Now what we're going to do is we're going to flip it. We're kind of going to create this um, flower-like feel. Go from the square feel to this flower-like feel and create these little indentations. So what you're going to do is you're going to take this spot here and we are going to fold. See this? Hope the focus is out. We're going to fold these part, this part to the opposite direction. So you're going to kind of pinch it here and then fold it over like so and just flatten it like that. You're probably like, what? So let me show you again. Take this side. You're going to see that there's a little zigzag part or little pleat. You're going to pinch it there and kind of fold it in the opposite direction. And as you do that, you're going to find that this part wants to go in. So you just fold it in and down like so, and it'll start to look like that. Does that make sense, Emily? Wait, what part? Oh, wait. Yeah, no. <laughs> I'm confused. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> what crease? So see this, um, see this part right here? Yeah. So what you're going to do is you're going to fold this over in the opposite direction. 
it's folded in one direction, you're going to fold it over in the opposite direction mm -hmm. and push it down. It's a little, it's a little bit small. Let's see if I can. Oh, okay, I see what you mean. Can I focus it? Oops. How do I focus it? Ah. <laughs> nope, can't do it. Can't focus it here. Nope, can't do it. Ah. <laughs> Are you doing manual focus? Trying it. Well, I don't know. I'm just trying to touch my iPhone, but I can't see it. Can't actually see what's happening. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, that makes me feel a little bit difficult. <laughs> I'll just share the screen for a second. Okay. Here we go. Where are we? Right here. Okay, I don't know if you can see this. Can you? We're going to fold this over. Fold this over in the opposite direction. Like that. And then you're going to take this part and push it down. See if I can improve the focus. All right. Let me show you with a new one. We've got this. Okay. And then we're going to take this part, fold it over in the opposite direction. You're going to see this part go down. So just let it go down, pinch it down, like so. I'm so glad I get so many attempts to show this to you. <laughs> okay. It just takes a little bit of, it kind of feels finicky, but it doesn't need to be exact. Even if it feels or looks a little rough from this side, once you flip it over, it, you know, it, it actually looks pretty good. So don't worry too much about it being exact or perfect, but just pinch it, push it down. And you're just going to get a little bit of a of indentation right there. Okay, is that making sense now? Yes, that makes sense. Thank you. Amazing. Okay, mm -hmm. is um is everybody? Oh, <laughs> oh no, Mookie says he surrenders. Don't surrender. No, you have to do it with us. If I figure it out, you can figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> you can do this. Okay. Lady Nightshot is asking if you do all, both sides. So do all four corners. Is this for, do, um, all you four, do, four? do all four corners. Hey, sup? Thank you for the follow. I think it's Phileng. I think he just followed. Or she just followed. Okay. Should look like this. Mookie Mookie, stay with us. You can do this. It's just uh, like this. And then you grab this and you just kind of almost just get your finger and just push it down squeeze it over it doesn't need to look perfect just squash it <laughs> squash it yeah okay like that got it it's sloppy patrick christopher sometimes using a toothpick oh that's oh, that, that is a hot tip look at that all right. <laughs> I'm just squishing it. Yeah, squish away. It's fine. Naive, just squish away. And like so. You can, after a while, you just get real fast at it. I'm like, ah, do, 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 do. That is true. You don't need to think about it. You don't need to overthink it. You do <laughs> a lot of shots. <laughs> just do it really quickly. All right. Du, du, du. See how quickly I can do this. Speed along. Yeah. Okay. So, Kat, are you still self quarantining, or are you kind of back to normal with everything? Uh, well, there's no normal anymore. <laughs> true. That is true. The new normal, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah. I mean, I I I go surfing once a week. Okay. I have a quarantine buddy that I go surfing with. Good. <laughs> so um, she and I hang out once a week and we go surfing and we play um, video games together. <laughs> I love that. I love that. We play Overcooked 
So, <laughs> <laughs> um, and so, yeah, we do that once a week. That's our like hangout session. And so we went, we did that yesterday. We went surfing and played Overcooked and ate it's bentos. <laughs> It sounds like the best way to spend a Friday. Pretty much. And so, yeah, we do that once a week. So she's basically the only, probably the only person I see, um, apart from my husband, of course, <laughs> and roommates regularly. Um, yeah. And so don't do, don't really do too much. Yeah. Cindy, pretty flowers. Thank you, Cindy. My stepmom. <laughs> oh, cool. Thanks for joining. Cindy. <laughs> Shout out to Cindy to do, do, do. Hey. From Michigan. <laughs> oh, Michigan, another Michigan. Yeah. Yes. We're hey. starting to overpopulate. I love it. <laughs> Second one was slightly better. That's it. You just got to keep doing it. That's the spirit. Just keep doing it and you will get better. It's the art of origami. <laughs> All right. Almost there. Okay. Do, 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 do. do you or your mate have a dog or is that just outside <laughs> it's just outside oh <laughs> I, I uh, usually close the window because the sound you know to have yeah. the audio but it's too hot today it's a hot day today mm -hmm. i think i'm done i don't know where everyone else is at but yeah i'm on my last one but i'm just gonna keep going so now we're gonna make a leaf so let me show you how to do this Where's the piece of paper I prepared earlier? No, I had one. Oh no, I've lost it. I guess I gotta make one. Okay, we'll make one. Right. Okay, let's do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, I also realized next week is um, 4th of July. Oh my God. So yeah. I'm guessing I probably shouldn't do the stream on the 4th of July. Um, not that I'm not sure I'm doing anything, but Same here. everyone else probably is. I might do a Twitch stream, but maybe I'll skip next week for the official origami stream. We'll see. But, uh, but I will be doing things on Twitch this week. So if anyone wants origami there, you just let me know. You can find me on Twitch. Okay. So let's start with our leaf now. We are going to fold corner to corner again. Surprise, surprise. And then, <laughs> Naive says, I'd watch, I'm still social distancing. Well, you know, if there's enough people who want me to do it next week, I'm not doing anything, I probably will. I'm trying to- I definitely will be watching. <laughs> I will let you know now. What's that? I said, I definitely will be watching. I'm oh, not okay. for four <laughs> <laughs> Okay. All right. And then we're going to corner to this corner up here, like so. <laughs> Have there been fireworks going off where you are? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, like every night. And it's like must be right in my neighborhood. Yeah. And yet last night I heard, or last night, I don't know, in the middle of the night, 4 a.m. fireworks. I was like, why? I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> yeah. It sounds like it's happening all over the country. Yeah. I don't know what what everyone's deal is. Like, I, I mean, like, I have no problem with fireworks, but 4 a.m. <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> okay. Oh, really? This side to this side. This side to this side. I know. I've been getting, um, I've been hearing a lot of neighbors complaining about it, and it, I guess it doesn't happen right next to us, so it's not as loud. But if it was That's happening right next to you, yeah, that would be crazy. It must be super close because every time, and I think they have the, I mean, I don't know anything about fireworks, but I think it must be the illegal kind because every time it, like, booms, it, like, my, my bed shakes a little. <laughs> oh, no. 
So it must be really close. Which, you know, I mean, it is what it is. I can't do anything about it, but. Mm -hmm. Okay, I must have did something wrong. Okay. You did? Oh, never mind. I, I figured it out. <laughs> okay. Can you show that again? Yes, for sure. And did my notification go off? No, it, I don't think it did this time. Oh, it might have for, for Pai Lang. Yeah. Oh, Amanda says, <laughs> she said, um, I think she must have just joined. She's like, I'll make it later. Bye. <laughs> okay. So like this, and then we're going to fold it over again. So this over again, like that. All the way from the start. I missed the very beginning. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Well, you'll probably see once we open it up. So it's like this. And like this. So it looks like a leaf. So you fold it in half. And then you fold this side in half. And then over and over. And then you open it up. So you kind of get this leaf-like thing, like that. That makes sense, right? Yes. Awesome. We're going to fold this over again. And now what you're going to do is you are going to um, kind of make a, f a fold from this corner to about here, something like that. So we're going to fold it over on a diagonal, like that. Oh, Wallace says, my paper was not cut right. No. Oh well, it's okay. <laughs> you can always watch back later and do this again. And then we're gonna open it up. Yeah, look at that, looks like a leaf. Well, we're gonna close it up again. I forgot one step. And then we are going to kind of create a another fold and it's gonna be a little rough. It's gonna be um, kind of like, I don't know, maybe like this. So, Fold it over like so, like that, and then over again like that. We're kind of making this leaf shape. That's what we're doing right now. Wait, can you do that again? Yeah. So, we've got this open. We're going to fold one side down like this. And then you're just going to fold this over so that it kind of meets right here. Okay. Yeah. And then fold it up and over and then split them up. And you just fold these back so that it makes that, creates that kind of leaf shape that we've got going here. Like that, and then this side, like so. Oh, nice and cute. Yeah, there's a leaf. These look like they're different sizes. <laughs> But it looks actually, it makes it realistic, you know? <laughs> yeah, they must have been different sizes. And then, um, and then you could get, really, I think you can get any type of paper that you want to just connect the pieces. I'm just going to get a slightly bigger one. But what we're going to do now is, um, is just glue them on. Like, I realize I don't have glue. <laughs> but you can make... <laughs> 
I'm going to use this blue, blue tacky stuff. This is called blue tack. It's from New Zealand. I'm just going to stick it on like that. Oh yeah, this is definitely a different size. But you would get glue and you would just stick the stuff on on top of each other. And then you would cut what's underneath afterwards, or you could cut beforehand, I guess. Whatever you want to do. That hour just flew by. It did. Wow. Okay. Yours is turning out so cute. It's kind of fun, huh? I love it. Yeah, I haven't done too many um, origami things where it's just more than one thing combined. Yeah. But this is kind of fun. Thank you for joining me today. Yeah, of course. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Like this. Yes. Wallace says, I think I need to go to Japan. Mm -hmm. Highly Let's recommend. Yeah. Bring this over here. Like so. Yeah, I guess that's enough. I'll just leave this one here for now. And then we can cut this out. Do, do, do. Cut it. Awesome. Here we go. We got it. Yay. <laughs> Yay. So cute. works that's so adorable i love it would have been perfect for mother's day yeah <laughs> you're right it would yeah how did everyone else's go turn out it might have been a little bit fast but if you finish this and um, want to take a photo and send it to me later i'll be more than stoked to share it with the world I'd love to see what you've done. Tag me too and I'll share it. <laughs> yeah. Did, have you have you finished yours? I did, but I don't have tape or anything to be able to put it together. So unfortunately it's just a layout. <laughs> You'll have to take a photo of it then and, and show me later. I will, I definitely will. Yeah, amazing. Well, thank you so much to everybody who um, who watched today, who joined me. Thank you so much, Emily, for joining yes. me. This has been so fun. It was a lot of fun. And, yeah, it really was so fun. <laughs> and and I, I do these every Saturday. I might even do it next Saturday because it looks like some of you will aren't doing anything for the 4th of July. And, uh, and, you know, these are always free. But if you would like to tip me, I use pay PayPal, I use Venmo, and um, you're more than welcome to do so. I'd be so stoked. I'll give you a shout out at the next origami session and um and then straight after this i'm gonna take a probably five ten minute break but i'm gonna be back on twitch just twitch this time doing some songs and for maybe for another hour or so and just hanging out over there so uh come find me on twitch i think i've got a link to that why it's twitch tv so i'm gonna put that in there twitch tv do, 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 do. is there anything you wanna you wanna plug emily you can find me everywhere uh, if you just search Emily to that. <laughs> Come Hi. follow me, follow back, have conversations, love meeting new friends. <laughs> so feel free to send me a DM. <laughs> awesome. That would be great. And I'll be I'll be here. I'll be at twitch.tv slash catmcdowell for about another hour. And I'm going to be streaming on there during the week. So, uh, and it's been pretty, it's been pretty quiet on there because I'm still so new to Twitch. So if you want to just come hang with me and... I can show you other origami things, or lately I've been working on kintsugi, which is a type of, um, oh, I'll, I'm going to get you and me back on here. It's a type of, um, it's an ancient Japanese art form of creating something new out of something broken using That's so beautiful. gold and brass. I don't use gold, but this is brass. <laughs> I love that. It's so pretty. Even like glass things, you know, you can make. Uh, this oh, was a chip. This was had a chip and a crack in it. So, 
just been um it's been I've just been making art and because I'm sitting here for hours doing this anyway, I do this on Twitch just <laughs> to hang while I sand things <laughs> and glue <laughs> things together. So yeah, I'll be there for another hour or so. Come join me if you like. And please go find Emily Tsuda. <laughs> and I guess I'll see you again here next week. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> cool. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye